Curious about the secrets behind the exceptional safety of air travel? From life-saving passenger capsules to hidden buttons in airplane bathrooms, let's soar into the world of aviation technology innovations you might not have heard about before. Passenger safety and security are paramount. That's why it's essential for airlines and companies to continually innovate. There are several innovations that you might not be aware of and have slipped under the radar. In fact, there have been some extraordinary projections ensuring that flights are prepared for unforeseen circumstances. What are they? Let's dive into the list compiled from various sources, Aircraft Safety and Security Technology Innovations. Considering the numerous aviation accidents, airlines and aviation companies constantly revamp themselves, innovating to introduce cutting-edge safety technologies, like the following designs. Ukrainian aviation engineer Vladimir Tatarenko has long been designing sophisticated passenger safety technology, an idea for an aircraft parachute. This design consists of a capsule within the aircraft's body, which can be ejected in seconds in the event of an air accident or problem. The tail of the plane will open. Then, a launcher will fire parachutes, pulling the capsule away from the aircraft's body. This cabin capsule will then be carried by the parachute and safely landed. A visualization of how this project works was uploaded on YouTube in 2013. However, it didn't garner much interest. It wasn't until the tragic crash of a Russian plane in Egypt in 2015 that this project regained attention, even leading to its re-upload and achieving 2 million views. Unfortunately, it remains just a design. Tatarenko refused offers from investors outside Ukraine solely because he wanted Ukrainian planes to be the first to implement it. Yet, no Ukrainian investor has shown interest in funding it perhaps due to the design's limitation, which only works for planes with rear doors, like Ukraine's Antonov aircraft. Thus, other planes wanting to implement this design would need major renovations to their tail sections and a reduction in seat capacity. The next technology pertains to flight issues caused by volcanic ash, like those experienced in 2010. Aircraft manufacturer Airbus, alongside EasyJet and Nakarnica Aviation, began developing a volcanic ash detector technology named AVOID, short for Airborne Volcanic Object Imaging Detector. It was first tested on an Airbus A340-300 in 2012. AVOID operates using two infrared sensor cameras mounted on the aircraft. These cameras emit waves that can detect elements and materials in volcanic ash, providing data for flights up to 7, 10 minutes ahead. This gives pilots the opportunity to avoid paths filled with volcanic ash. Flight safety indeed depends on crew collaboration, including the captain in the cockpit. A pilot's skill is crucial for maneuvering the aircraft under certain conditions. Many aircraft accidents have been attributed to pilot negligence. To address this issue, there has been significant development in unmanned aircraft technology. In 2017, Boeing conducted a trial of this concept. However, their research showed that only young people were willing to try flying in an unmanned aircraft. However, it's important to remember that airplanes are designed from the start to fly safely and comfortably to their destinations. Thus, many existing aircraft technologies have been in use for a long time. You might not even notice them because they have become so commonplace. First, it's important to follow instructions from the flight crew, even the smallest ones, for your safety. For instance, the practice of dimming lights during takeoff and landing is a standard safety measure. In aviation, there's a term called the critical 11, referring to the 11 most critical minutes in a flight, three minutes after takeoff and eight minutes before landing. The standard operating procedure of dimming lights during takeoff and landing aims to help passengers' eyes quickly adjust to darkness. So, in the event of a takeoff or landing error, passengers are not shocked and the situation can be more easily controlled.
Then there's a feature in the form of yellow hooks with two holes attached to both sides of the aircraft wings. The number of these hooks varies with each aircraft and they are small in size, but their function is vital. Captain Joe from Airbus A320 explains that in the event of an emergency landing, passengers need to exit through the aircraft onto a slide. However, if landing on water, the wings are usually slippery. Hence, ropes are needed for passengers to hold on to while sliding to avoid falling. The aforementioned hooks are used to secure these ropes from the wing surface to the aircraft door. Next, if you look closely at an airplane window, you'll notice a small hole. This is not just any hole, it serves as a safety valve and protects passengers. As is known, after takeoff, the aircraft ascends to higher altitudes where temperatures decrease. These small holes help equalize the temperature and pressure inside the cabin. They also prevent the windows from fogging up, breaking, or expanding. Interestingly, smoking on airplanes has been prohibited for a long time, with the U.S. pioneering this ban in 1971. Initially, airplanes had designated smoking areas in the cabin. The complete ban was officially implemented in 1988. However, as early as 1977, Arigny Air Services became the first airline to fully ban smoking on all their flights. All these measures were taken for the safety and comfort of everyone, but even though smoking is illegal and a universally accepted rule, airlines still provide ashtrays, usually located in restrooms. This is to anticipate any fire hazards from passengers who might insist on smoking. A common feature is the emergency oxygen system. This is an emergency equipment system used when the cabin air pressure fails. It consists of individual yellow oxygen masks stored in compartments near passenger seats, as well as in the toilet and kitchen areas. There's also a supply source of oxygen from oxygen cylinders. This means every flight is already prepared for the worst case scenarios from the start. And to anticipate unwanted incidents in the cabin, such as fires or hijackings, airlines have equipped a secret button in the bathroom door. It's usually located behind the lavatory or do you see sign. This button is used to open the toilet door, allowing passengers to enter for safety. Additionally, the phrase, let me know when you've arrived, is more than just a casual conversation between friends or family. It's important for your loved ones to know you've arrived safely.